So, welcome to my video tutorial about to build on this co-ball. Um, at first, um, thanks for your um, votes on Facebook. And so we want to start right now. Uh, you see here the results of the of the finished um, rendering. Um, so we start at first to build the texture. We need a texture. So we go to front view, auto graphic, that's correct. And then we build a circle. Mesh. Circle. Ah, moment. I make the render keys here. Uh, the screen is on. So I wrote it x90. Um, we scale that in the middle of that. Um, edit mode, um, F to close, uh, Shift D to duplicate that, grab, and make that in the middle. I make it behind. Here is an axis, here is an axis. So make it uh, free. Uh, feel free to make it better like I am, uh, so no problem. I make it free, so we see. Okay. Uh, we have to four corners and all four corners. We want to make an alpha texture that is um, take, uh, seamless, and that's why we're doing that. So we have that. That uh, is the texture where the light comes out later. So um, go here, and um, the settings uh, must be set. So. Uh, make it on GPU if you have a good uh, graphic card. Uh, we we'll make the resolution to 1024 uh, at both. And then quality is 100%. And then we want to make an animation. Uh, so we need another format. The format is um, this one. And the encoding should be MPEG 4. Uh, it's less than a megabyte uh, when we render, so it's good. Um, the sampling, we make it a 9 and to 7 in the preview. Um, the clamp in direction we need later. Uh, it's um, point .03. Yeah, um, we must see it, but I think it was not 3. Yeah, uh, okay. I will see it later. Um, so uh, we need a um, transparency on um, background. So we click here on transparency and film. Okay, and that's all I think for first. Um, so we get the camera. Go in camera view. Oh, you see all is wrong. We need auto graphic. Go out of the camera, numpad zero, and um, delete the rotations that we make in the property um, window. Press N, and you see there is rotation from the cam, and we make it all to zero. So does the cam looks from top view to this. And now you see it's not top. Um, so we must, um, the camp is top view, but not this. So um, we take this and rotate it in 90. So, okay. Camera about, about. Uh, and we see nothing. Of course, we grab it, scale it. Like, like this, you must be really in the middle of this hole. So, see, okay, um, we render it, and you see, we got an alpha with um, our material. Okay, save it, save as an image. Surely we must take on um, PG. PG is um, with the alpha canal. 
channel and um, click that there and um, give them a name. Uh, I make it before, so we take the same name, uh, Alpha Texture 1. Okay, we have make an Alpha Texture and delete them now because that's okay. Now we rotate the camera back. So now we start with the real. Okay, we add a cube. Um, scale them a little. Then edit mode. Uh, faces. Select front face X and um, only faces delete. So we have a cube we can see inside. Wonderful. Really. Um, leave the edit mode into the object mode. Tap and uh, make a new material. This material we uh, let be diffuse. It's okay for, for starting. And um, now we make the lamp, the light that comes out of the sphere later. We make it with point light. Must scale the size. The size should be 0 0.0001. Of course, the shadow is sharper there. So make you use nodes and give them a um, yellow light. Later we will animate that um, for changing, but not now. So we go in front view and add a sphere. Add mesh sphere. That's okay, 32 segments. Scale it a little bit like you want. Okay, now we had the light. The light should be into the sphere. So grab it. Must need it not uh, be perfectly, but it should be inside. So it's good enough. Make it fast. Good. Uh, then we need a material for the sphere. Uh, what's transparency? So we take the node editor, make a um, material on the sphere. Uh, say that is an image that we want to use. This image we built it um, before. But we first must cut this because it's from color. We want to use the alpha. So we um, hold. Um, the control key and with the left mouse button we can cut that. Wonderful. So uh, when we take a texture you must um, before make an unwrap of this object. So we go in edit mode and hit U and that is a sphere. So you make a sphere projection. Wonderful. Now we have a UV. Tap again go out okay now we add here an input the input must be on um, text to coordinate there is our uv but what we must map them um that is a vector mapping this mapping is for the scale for the rotation for the location from the texture that we make from the alpha texture so we take this uv and put vector and this one into the image so we have a diffuse material now but um, there is an alpha channel on the image uh, so we need an other shader a mix of shader um, the first one is the moment where is it transparent shader that should be mixed in a mixed shader logic. Uh, you take the currency on and say take this to mix the image mix between the diffuse and the transparent. Okay, you can see it in the preview later. Uh, so we must um, take the image where we saved it. It was texture one alpha texture one and so we see there's one hole in wonderful 
so we see that this um too too big the hole is too big so we must scale them the the image that we can make here um we set them to um 0 0.06 Point zero six at both here too. Point six okay, and you see it in the preview. Wonderful, wonderful. Oh, typed wrong. Point zero six. So okay, now we see it's wonderful. It's with many holes, but uh, when you look in a disco at this uh, sphere, you will see this um, normally mirrors. So we must make the material like a mirror. How oh, we can make that? No problem. Take a um, mix shader again and add a um, uh, glossy shader to it. Make it 50 50, and you see there's a reflection roughness. We make uh, to zero, so it's a um, mirror. Not perfectly, you can change it here to make it completely or less uh, from the reflections. You must know that. Try. Okay. So we had that. The, the lamp is correctly with 100 frames. That is wonderful. Okay. So we make a test render. What we see? Oh, we have points on the sides. Wonderful. Real classic. Don't ask me um, why is there a cut, for, I think, from the UV. Uh, unwrapping that is the fail uh, you can mark seam and um, change it but we are on the basics um, we want to make fog inside because we want to see the light cones so we add an object uh, a cube scale um, so and this object should be the fog so, if the material, see in the node editor, it is plugged in surface, but we want not surface, cut them and make them in volume, but not a diffuse, we need another one, uh, another one, and the volume scatterer is there, um, he can make it, you see it in the preview, like fog. There is fog, and with these um, values, you can say how thick uh, the fog is and um, how good the visibility of the cone. So, we take here a density of 0.3, and for the other 0.4. So, you don't see that, but it is there. But we need a an, an light effect because the light must go through that. So we see in the render, now we have the strokes there. Wonderful. That is all about, you know. Um, oh, sorry. Um, I must take the camera there, then you can see. Uh, we make then the animation for that all. So the camera is set. Look, okay, we must um, put them a little bit out. See it all. Okay, so leave it. Okay. Now um, we want to make the animation. The animation of the um, sphere rotation and the color changing. So hit them. Make here a timeline. Um, you can animate um, the position of that and the rotation and all. Uh, making it with hit I and lock rot scale. That's for location, rotation, scale. It takes all. Uh, we want to make it like 140 um, frames. Take it here, 140. Wonderful. Um, now uh, we had a key here. Set another key at the end by turning it around. So we make rotation set completely round wonderful take i rotation scale and you see it turns wonderful 
but now we want to make the change of the colors um, select the lamp first is yellow okay we set here a key with pressing i on it okay one is set then to 40 make another color like red hit i wonderful and so on blue i and here in green hit i okay so we see color turns wonderful rotation is there so we can render it it is done um yeah i make only um picture you can render that later oh i must put the fuck in sure so okay and you see wonderful it is done when you want to uh, make it sharper or uh, other looking states you can feel free uh, to edit this yeah and there are many ways to do that um, and feel free to experiment with that yeah um, this one clamp indirect um, is for the fireflies to make them uh, go and um, you can try all other things yeah okay um i hope it was um hopeful for you. Uh, um, uh, you learned something and i uh, hope we see us in another tutorial if you want to uh, see another um write me and we will see how we can make it uh, thank you a lot and bye bye